So you want to work on Linux but do not want to set up a separate operating system or a virtual box to do that? No problem. In this video, I am going to show you how you can use Linux on your Windows machine using WSL. WSL or Windows Subsystem for Linux provides you a Linux distribution inside your Windows operating system without using any virtual box or any separate operating system you don't have to do anything you just need to install wsl and in this video i'm going to show you how you can use wsl to use any linux distribution like ubuntu debian red hat SUS, any operating system that you want so let's get started start with the video if you haven't subscribed to cloud champ please subscribe for more videos on aws cloud linux and devops let's get started once you are here click on the search icon and then search for Turn Windows feature on or off in the control panel. Once you click on it, a page will appear and scroll down to find Windows subsystem for Linux. You will find it here. Check the box and now click on OK. Once you click on OK, it will search for required file and install it which are necessary for Windows subsystem or WSL to run. Now that you have installed it, click on the restart now option which will restart your computer. I'm going to click on and then your machine is started you can choose to install WSL right from the Microsoft Store so you can open your Microsoft Store and search for any Linux distribution like Ubuntu or SUS so I'm here in my Microsoft Store and I'm going to search for Linux and you can find all these different uh, apps but another way to install WSL is by opening CMD so I'm going to open CMD here maximize this I'm going to run WSL hyphen hyphen install it will show me all the list of different distributions so I have Ubuntu, Debian, Kali Linux and different uh, distributions here to install any of these you need to run this command which is WSL dash dash install space dash T which is the distribution name and I'm going to run the name which is Ubuntu so UBUNTU hyphen 20 because I'm going to install 20.04 once you do that press enter you can choose to install any distribution you can go for Debian Kali Linux whatever you want I want WSL for Ubuntu so I'm going to press enter and after running this command so now you can see it's going to install Ubuntu in my machine let's wait for the installation to be complete WSL I'm going to search for Ubuntu here which is Ubuntu 20 on Windows and this is so installing this may take few minutes it says WSL2 requires an update to its kernel component so if you get an error something like this you just need to type WSL hyphen hyphen update once you run this it's going to update all the WSL packages for Linux and you will not get the same error which you were getting so let's wait for the update to be done and so I'm going to run WSL hyphen hyphen shutdown. This distribution failed with an error. The operation could not be started because a required feature is not installed. You get the same error. Make sure you have Hyper-V and WSL installed here. So you can need to click on this, click on OK here, and it will start installing for the required files, applying changes, and it might also require you to restart your PC. So I'm going to restart now have restarted let's try again to open our WSL so I'm going to open the Ubuntu which we have installed and you can see it has brought me inside my machine so I am here in my Ubuntu machine let me show you that so I'm going to cat to show you the machine name so etsy os dash release and it says it's an Ubuntu machine 20.04 so this means we have successfully installed Ubuntu in sudo apt update is going to work for me because this is now an Ubuntu machine. So if you have any issues, any questions, you can let me know in the comment section. Make sure you have Hyper-V and WSL enabled here in the turn windows feature on and off. If you still get the issue, make sure you have WSL installed and updated in the command prompt. 
any question any doubt let me know in the comment section i hope this was informative please subscribe for more videos like this thank you and have a good day